Coffee and lose weight. Coffee and lose weight. Coffee is very controversial when it comes to weight loss. Some claim that it helps you with weight loss. Others claim that your diet just gets in the way. The truth lies in the middle. Coffee can have both positive and negative effects on weight loss, depending on the way of consumption and other factors. How coffee can strengthen your diet? Coffee contains caffeine, a stimulant. It allows you to be more alert and more active, which will ultimately lead to weight loss. In addition, tea functions as a mild appetite suppressant. Drinking coffee during the afternoon or after dinner can help to reduce the craving for snacks or candy because it fills your stomach and your appetite is suppressed without that you ingest a lot of calories. Coffee stimulates your metabolism as you thermogenesis. The way your body burns calories to generate heat and energy increases. But this is only a small increase and there have been no studies have been able to demonstrate that this is a very large effect on weight loss. Coffee is often seen as diuretic, but studies have shown that drinking coffee in average quantities does not lead to reducing the moisture level in your body. In fact, drinking coffee increases your fluid intake as much as drinking water. Good news for those who love coffee, but not so much by water. Although coffee sometimes responsible for increasing the insulin resistance, what can eventually lead to diabetes? Recent studies have shown that coffee itself is not the cause of insulin resistance. It's usually the sugar we do that in our coffee, as well as other unhealthy food choices we make. There are also scientists who claim that coffee source of antioxidants the insulin sensitivity increases. Although this is not yet officially has been scientifically demonstrated. How coffee can impair your diet? When you drink too much coffee, the caffeine cause your stress level increases which can lead to excessive eating. Also, it can cause insomnia, once again demonstrating the intake of calories can increase. Tea also contains other chemicals that the production of cortisone and adrenaline in your body. These substances increase the amount of stress you have in your body experiences, and specifically cortisone also called linked to an increase in abdominal fat. What more health problems than fat in other areas on the body? Coffee itself contains very few calories and no fat, but people drink it but rarely without something to add. Even a touch of sweet syrup can all add calories to a cup of coffee. And some of the more creamy and rich coffees may contain as many calories as a complete meal. Milk and cream also contain a lot of saturated fat, which not only adds calories, but also bad for your health. Too much saturated fat can lead to heart disease. In short, the effects of coffee on weight loss are insufficient to ensure that you arrive or fall off significantly. The best advice is to consume coffee in moderation and if desired you to be aware of the effects it can have on your body and that way you benefit.